Hello everyone, welcome to this YouTube channel, myself Roslyn and in this video we will see how to count rows in an excel table using power automate flow and these are the two different actions that we are going to use to count rows in an excel table using power automate flow. So let's begin, open the SharePoint site and select the location where your excel file exists. In my case, my excel file is presented in the SharePoint document library, one is employees, another one is customers. So open the employees excel sheet and in this table you can see there are totally nine rows are presented now we will see how to calculate these rows using power automate flow for that log into the power automate flow using the microsoft credentials click on this create option and choose the instant cloud flow enter the flow name choose the trigger as manually trigger a flow and click on this create option the trigger has been added now select new step select list rows present in a table action now configure the location document library file and table which are the required fields so select the location where the excel file exists in my case this is the sharepoint site where my excel file is located and from the document library choose the documents and from the show picker select the excel file for which you want to count rows here i am going to count rows for the employee excel workbook after that under drop down select the table value now select new step add a compose data operation and pass the input length of output of the previous action which is list rows present in a table and its body value click on this ok button here you can see our formula has been added now click save to save the flow and choose the test option click manually and choose test and it is asking for sign in permission click continue and choose the run flow option now click done now our flow runs successfully and gets all the rows from the employee workbook and it returns the output value count as 9 just because in our excel workbook there are 9 rows are presented so this is how to count rows in an excel table using power automate flow now i will show you for another excel workbook that is present in the SharePoint document library called customers. In customers excel workbook you can see there are only 5 rows are presented. Come back to our created flow. Click on this edit option. Instead of employees choose the file customers and from the drop down choose the table value and click on this save option here. Choose test and click on this run flow option. Click done. Our flow ran successfully here. Here you can see it lists all the rows that are presented in the customers excel book table and it returns the output value as 5 because there are 5 rows presented in the customers excel workbook table. I hope you get an idea of how to count rows in an excel table using the power automate flow. Thanks for watching this video and these are the free video tutorials that are presented in our youtube channel. Please check it out and please do subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos. Thank you.